so this is a good place to start. So on the left hand side, we have the urge order sort, and it says your first chord should be an A flat one one. Sure enough, there it is. Your second chord should be a A flat one three. There it is. And those are all the minor urge chords. Then we come down to all the major urge chords, which are in blue over here, and that is the B flat one one. And then we come on down to the minor and major urge chords, which is the orange, and that's an A flat one two. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a recap of Composing in Motion Part 10 Console. In today's episode, we entered with two key ideas. We wanted to try something called gamakas, which is a melodic figure from Indian Carnatic music, and um, what they call wave and double note and others are like percussion notes, we realized, to uh, what we've been working with in uh, the drum figures. They give us new ideas for figures, and we also learned how to add microtones. What do we mean by that? Here we'll show you. So, carefully watching a YouTube video, we first did some slides like this. No slide. Slide. Now a descending slide. And technically, we would show that the slide occurred from here to here. It's, a, it's an ornamentation. Now, here we have a scale. Then we add what's called a, uh, a wave or compatom. Then double notes on the first four notes of the scale. And then vibration. And that took a long time uh, to try to, we were transcribing it from an actual YouTube voice demonstration. Then finally we learned that we could actually adjust between our notes. But you see there's an A flat here. But we found a way between here you can hardly hear it and that's um, every every two notes are separated but we're called a hundred centines or something like that so we just kicked it up by 50 centines which is what that plus 50 cents means it's like a hundred cents to a dollar so that was pretty cool. So we've got new areas to work with, and this is so much composing in motion. It's very much composing in motion. Using these ornaments is very much composing in motion. So that's pretty cool stuff. Now, then we return to our spreadsheet work. And you may recall that we've been working with this, uh, this one scale, the, the, uh, the 2662557 scale. And um, what we did today is we added all these different colored columns. And each different column shows a different way to sort it. And we sorted it based on did it have a root note in it, did it have a neutral note in it, did it have a 
shared, none note, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. And, they, and then while we were doing that, um, <laughs> we said, people might ask, why are we doing, why are we doing all this spreadsheet sort work? Cord database and sorting work. And it's to create music that sounds cool. And, and that's it. And, and by by using different chords, we can add texture, depth, and power to varying motif lines. And we, as we went along, we kind of tried to demonstrate that over here. We we went up and and showed two different kind of simple four line melodies you could use. Like up here, we had an A flat two four. Uh, we play this. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And then A flat one two, which comes from down here. La da da da. That's a B flat, A flat, B, B flat. Now that was coming out of the the kind of the original sort order. Now the same thing, B flat, A flat, B, B flat. If we try it in a mode order, and it just means we, we pick the first example tonic and the first subtonic and the first blah, 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 blah. Now in this order, we could start on this one. Da! But we don't have that, that chord we were looking for a minute ago. So we had to use this one. Da! And then we went to Da. And then we went to, and those are very different. That same motif, yet a very different uh, underlying harmonic boom, uh, richness to it. So we did we did six of those. So all in all, we added. Um, We made, we got to put that in there. We made gamakas, made four sample gamakas, which we just played for you. And then we uh, began testing our further, oh no, that doesn't go here, does it? That goes up here. Yeah, we already did it. Yeah, we did all this. This is what we did here. So we made a gamica score and we added slide, wave, double notes and vibration and 50 cent tuning. We did, um, it reminds us of a rap singer, doesn't it? And we extended the sort orders, blah, 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 blah. And we made six more. So what we're gonna do for you now is, uh, why don't we just play the gamicas because those are kind of the new, fun, exciting things. We'll play all of them at once, and then that'll take us home. Here we go. So that concludes today's stream. Our ideas for next time are, uh, well, we have some more ideas to, uh, um, you know, more technical ideas. But compose further with the gamakas and the sword order cherry picking. 
Acknowledgements to Mana Floa who stopped by and Red Devil who stopped by. Thank you very much for your comments. Tune in next time to see what happens. Do take care. Do come back. And do keep on streaming.